Well, here I am, enjoying the Dublin sun with Ruja. Ruji. Ruja. <laughs> Ruja was very abused when she was little, so she's, uh, she's very timid uh, at the moment, so she'll come out into the backyard just for a few minutes, but not for very long, and usually when you're with her. Oh, here she comes. Hello. So, I just got back from the shops wearing this, which is uh, a VIP t-shirt, not your ma, not your milk. So we wanted to make an Irish version. You know, the North Americans say mom, and in Britain they say mum. And so we wanted to uh, make an Irish version, so we put not your ma. In fact, uh, we were gonna do a real kind of Dublin version and say not your mammy, but we thought that was go going a bit too much. Actually gets quite a lot of attention, this, uh, when you're in the shops. Especially, I, I, was, uh, I was in a supermarket the other day and um, I was wearing this and somebody had uh, one of those big, you know, I don't know, whatever it is, two, two, three litre things of milk and she laid it down on the conveyor belt in front and covered it over <laughs> with other things, which I thought was quite good. This morning, or just now, just got back, this woman said, um, does that mean what I think it means? And I said, well, it depends on what you think it means. It said, um, it's something to do with cow's milk. And I said, yeah. And I said, you know, from a vegan point of view, it's quite odd, really. You know, we are mammals. Mammals become weaned. And yet what we do as a species is we transfer from our own species to mother's milk from a different species. So I haven't never really thought about it that way. I actually did breastfeed myself. I said, yeah, well, it's interesting, isn't it? In the sense that uh, presumably you dried up. And she said, well, yeah, that's what happens. I said, yeah, that's what happens with cows too. And so the way that uh, they keep the milk flowing is by keeping them pregnant. And after they do that six or seven times, then the mother cows are usually regarded in the industry as spent. There is a term called spent cow in the same way as spent hen. And spent basically means worn out. And so uh, we had a good chat. And she said uh, again, well, that's really given me something to think about because I've never thought about it in those terms before. Of course, um, you know, I went on to talk about uh, rights and rights violations and uh, gave her a couple of websites that she might check out. So. Seed planted. Okay, see you again sometime, probably <laughs> when it's raining again. Bye for now. I gotta go vegan. I gotta go vegan. Hang on, is this a new Stevie Wonder classic? Go vegan. Go vegan. Go vegan. Go vegan. Go vegan. Go vegan. Go vegan.